Hey guys, welcome back to Clarity Chart Analysis. And in this video, I will be using the market structure to tell us our current position of the telcoin on the price market chart, and also use the market structure to predict the next possible move of the telcoin. But first, guys, if you're new to this channel and you want to make money on both directions of the market, you want to know our current position on the price market chart. This channel is for you. Please subscribe, like, and put on the notification to be notified anytime I drop a new video. So guys, on our major structure, which is our daily time frame, the most recent breakup structure we saw was a breakup structure to the downside, and guys, we're expecting a pullback. For us to be on a pullback phase, guys, we need price to trade above this swing that gave us this lower low, and guys, we've seen price traded above it. So guys, do you think we're, on a we're done with the pullback phase? Because after we saw price traded above it, with some price break out this from this structure that gave us this iii and currently now price is close to a lower swing of the daily time frame lower low so guys let's go back to a four hour time frame let's go see if we can get more information about market structure but knowing fully well the price is trading between this upper swing and this lower swing so guys on our four hour time frame what do we notice we noticed that it was actually the swing that gave us this low low and we've seen price traded above it price pull back gave us another ii and pull back and give us another eye telling us that we're on a bullish trend on our four hour time frame which just facilitates or we just align with a pullback on our daily time frame so guys from this point we now saw a break of structure to the downside which tells us that price has changed direction back to a bearish trend, telling us that now the 4-hour time frame is bearish and our daily time frame is also bearish. So guys, our 4-hour time frame now is trading between this upper swing and this lower swing. So guys, what do you think? Do you think after breaking this structure to the downside, we should be expecting the pullback? Do you think price will just pull back a little before we continue seeing more break of structure to the downside? Or guys, do you think from this point, price will just continue breaking more structure to the downside? Let's go back to a one hour time frame. Let's go see if we can get more information about market structure. So guys, let's look at this. After we saw a break of structure to the downside, we saw price okay it was actually the swing that gave us this lower low so we saw price trade above it and from there we saw a break of structure to the downside the pullback and a break of structure so guys currently now our one hour time frame is bearish our four hour time frame is bearish and also our daily time frame is bearish so guys tell talk our telcoin token is actually bearish put on our all three time frames so anything we should be doing should just be in a way of getting a nice entry point to shut the market because both three time both three time frames one hour four hours and daily time frames are telling us that we are still bearish all of them we just the most recent break of structure we saw on all of them was actually break of structures to the downside so guys let's trade carefully so we won't lose our ad end money trading the wrong direction of telcoin so guys thank you for watching this video clarity chart analysis is here to give updates on market structure but guys, for you not to miss out, please subscribe, like, and put on the notification to be notified anytime I drop a new video. Thank you guys for watching this video.